We do have a couple of brief announcements this evening. First of all, I want to take this opportunity to thank staff and uh, all, the, all of the staff that was out this last weekend, in fact today, for all of the work they did, the removing trees and cutting limbs and picking up mud and doing all of the things they had to do. We had some very serious situations. Thank goodness nobody was hurt. We had some evacuations going on and some very serious tree, uh, um, tree situations falling on a lot of cars, but it was all um, equipment and it was all um, cars and no, no lives lost and uh, nobody really hurt. So I just want to thank staff because I know they did an outstanding job. Police, fire, everyone in this city really did a lot of work. And there's more to come. This is only January 10th, so thank them. Also, on, a, on another note, a uh, author in Pacifica, Jean Bartlett, wrote a book, and the book is called Roll Call Reveille, and it highlights, um, happens to highlight, a number of veterans from the Civil War all the way up to present day that are buried in Colma Cemetery, and the reason I bring it up is because one of those highlighted uh, articles is on our own Tom Lara from the city of San Bruno. So it's a very interesting book, and they go into detail on all of these different people, all, like I said, all the way from World War I, the Civil War, all the way up to present day, and it's very interesting. So it's called Roll Call Reveille by Jean Bartlett, and I have a copy here if somebody wants to see it after. And uh, I just wanted to give her a plug because it's, it's really interesting. 